It's hard to believe that we've just passed the 10 year anniversary of the loss of Seve Ballesteros, arguably one of the most, if not the most iconic golfer of all time. It's very difficult to create one piece of work that encapsulates what somebody like Seve meant to somebody and actually document their career in one piece of work. But I believe that David Cannon, with his book, His Life Through a Lens, has done a fantastic job. Now, great photography is something that I really do appreciate. And when you mix a great photographer like David and you get a character like Seve Ballesteros, you would have come out with some of the most iconic golf images of all time. Now the book starts with a chapter called Seve, the young star, and obviously David's been taking photographs of Seve for some time. So we get photographs of Seve in his very early playing days, some images that I'd not seen before. And it takes us through the early part of his career, of course. And then we move into sections where we're talking about his majors, his major victories. Again, some images that I've never seen before. There are one or two in here that are obviously quite iconic that you will have seen. So for me, this is the perfect body of work that encapsulates Seve's career and his life, really, all the way from the very early years and all the way through to, obviously, the very sad end. Now, the book's not just pretty pictures. There is some text. There is some reading to be done as well. But to be honest, the main body of work is the photographs. They are absolutely fantastic. The quality of the paper that's being used to produce this book is of a very high standard as well. And to me, that makes all the difference. If you've got images that are as good as this, there's no point in putting it on cheap paper. So for all fans of golf, and even if you're not a golf fan and you just like a nice photograph, this is definitely a book to have on the bookshelf or the coffee table. Now it's unusual for me to endorse something like this on this channel, it's usually just equipment reviews and swing tips, but I was so impressed by this work by David that I thought I'd share it with you because I think it's something that a lot of you would like to purchase. And if you'd like to get yourself a copy of this, I've left you a link in the description of this video. Now I'm gonna grab myself a cup of tea, sit down, and immerse myself in this for a little bit longer. See you soon.